is going head to head with EA. EA is the me too. They're the you know Johnny come lately. We talked to e, uh, EA Sports, and you know what EA Sports said? It's not a real sport. Those aren't real athletes, and we'd never make a video game out of that. So like a typical goofball company, you know, this one comes out and, and, and does very well. And they're like, oh, okay, me too. Now it's a sport. Now it's a sport. And these guys are real athletes because we want to make some money off it. EA sucks. Well, Connor, Connor has to defend his title or make a decision to, uh, to give it up or whatever he wants to do. I don't know. I got to sit down and, and, and see what's next. So if you were Connor, what would you do? If I was Connor, I'd defend my title. What happened is we're trying to, we're, we're building a database now. We're putting up all the fighters who have ever fought in the UFC. And for some reason, there was a story connected to UFC 200 about Brock because he was in UFC 100, and that thing popped up. So we're not expecting to see Brock Lesnar in the UFC octagon anytime soon. <laughs> Listen, Lesnar had a great run here. He retired, um, I think, at the right time, and, you know, he, he had a good run. Now he's with the WWE. And, and when he signed that deal with the WWE, I felt like that was the right thing to do. But it was fun when we had him, and, you know, that, that was weird that that happened. Reaction to Darren Ravel's story about the UFC uh, <laughs> up for sale, or is there a possible partial sale of the UFC? Yeah, we're not up for sale. We're, we're always doing, uh, you know, we're always working on deals and our expansion <clears throat> globally. Uh, he's recovering all right? He is. Uh, when are we going to see women in the uh, UFC, man? Never. Never? <laughs> Never. All right, have a good Thank night, you man. Guys. Thank you. Right, Thank man. you man. I appreciate you, man.